What is good, everybody? Killer KP Notcher here, back with Pokemon Emerald. Uh, last episode, we struggled to evolve our Swablu, and we soon learn out, or we find out that Swablu doesn't evolve until level 35. Instead, we evolved Optimus. So, oh, let me put gas for him away. Drop him off in the PC. Do do do. Store, there we go. Alright. So let's see. Today's episode, we're going to take a look around Fortree City. And, uh, yeah. And we'll find out what we're going to do. Um, so yeah. As you enter the city, off of room one, Route 119, there's Pokemon Center and Pokemon as always. And the thing I like about Fortree City is that it's in the forest and everyone's houses are like on top of trees and stuff so they're all tree houses so let's check out this first house Roar! I need it I have to get me a Volby I'll do anything for it uh did you hear that my shout from the bottom of my heart haven't heard that will you trade me a Volbeat for my plusle won't you I do not have a Volbeat I did I released it <laughs> oh man so yeah that kid will trade you a Volbeat or if you give him a Volbeat he'll give you a plusle trade Pokemon with others it's as if you're trading your own memories with other people. Wide words of wisdom from grandma. Do Check out this house. Another old lady. So many old people. People. Pokemon. Their hidden powers are aroused by living in natural environments. Let this old woman see if your hidden power has awoken. I hold a coin in my hand. Now tell me. Have I palmed it in the right hand or in the left? Uh, left. No, too bad you guessed wrong. Oh, let's try that again. Right. Yay. Well, shall try again. What? We shall try again. Which hand have I palmed the coin? Right or left? Left. Damn. All right, whatever. <laughs> hmm. My wife relies on hidden power to stay awake. She should... Uh, she should just take a nap like I do and sleep talk. And this guy will teach you sleep talk. That's cool. There's a lot of little things in this village. Check out... Oh, and you can't run on top of these little platforms. Kinda sucks. Let's talk to this guy. While well, speaking about Pokédexes, I remember something. I met this trainer, Steven. Eh. I met this trainer. I met this trainer, Steven, when I was searching for rare stones. Who, boy, he had some amazing Pokémon with him. They weren't just rare; they were trained to terrifying extremes. He might even be stronger than the gym leader of this town. And what's that thing you have there? Oh, it's called a Pokédex. That's really awesome. Oh, what a loser. And if you try to go down here to fight Jim, there's something in the way. And we'll probably discover that today. What's this guy got to say? No one believes me, but I saw this gig saw this gigantic Pokemon in the sky. It seemed to squirm as it flew towards Route 131. By the way, Sniff, um, you uh smell si sing. Were you at a volcano or something? Oh, that's cool. Let's talk to this guy. There, go bird Pokemon. Oh, okay. What? Did it? He yeah, asked my Wingo to run the air for me. Oh, I wish I could do that. By being together with Pokemon, people make more and more friends. And that brings the world closer. I think it's wonderful. That's great. And then if we go down here, this is Lady I say, blah blah. So yeah, she wants to fight the gym. The ground is towards rain water and she's go by drinking that water. Our fortress city exists because of both water and soil. Ooh, science! This is a shop, I believe you can buy. Yep, things for your little, um. Uh. Can't remember what they're called. For your hidden bases, which we will be going over after I beat Elite Four. Stuff like that will be, like, post game, I guess. Because I don't want to waste time doing it right now. Pokemon people have adapted to the nature for survival. There's no need to make nature conform. Com uh, there's no need to make nature conform to the way we want to live. The tree house and four trees are great. The, the, the tree houses and four tree are, four tree are great. I think it's the number one town for living together. With Pokemon. Me too, lady. Me too. All right. So let me switch my Pokemon really quick to shrooms. 
So yeah, um, today is Saturday, the something 23rd, I think. Oh, the, 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 uh, today's Saturday, the 23rd, and I'm recording it. We're gonna record this episode. Wow, I can't, I don't, mm, Why am I carrying this parasol? If I tell you, can you win against me? Yeah, that's a kicker, but... My punch to the face. Crit hit. Boy! Level 32, that's cool. Wilmer. Get hit with that one. Nah, Mega Drain. Alright, good looks, good looks. So, let's see. Do we have Pokemon I can... Nope. So, I can't remember... Oh, more grass like this. Come on. Poochiana. Die. So, yeah, we're going to be catching our... Final party member this episode, if I can find him or her. No, not you, Poochiana. Come on. No, not you, Mighty Anna. Why are all these Pokemon female? <laughs> My game freaking out or something? Nope, no item there. Come on. Not an Oddish. So, yeah, um. I'm gonna speed it up, and when I get the Pokemon I'm looking for to show up, then I'll be back. So, burb. guys we found him the final member of our team Absol Absol hold up let me pull up the stuff for Absol Absol I probably should have gotten this ready earlier so yeah um let's see Absol is a dark type Pokemon so yeah let's hope it doesn't run away I'm going to use fly Oh yes, and no sword stance, perfect. So yeah, um, I didn't know who else to use for my uh, team, and I feel like Absol makes a perfect member for the team. So we're close to that. We were close to the area where we were gonna find him, so I decided why not to use him, get it over with. Alright, we got him into yellow. So let's see. Um, Pokeballs. Yep, there you go. It's time to huck some balls. Uh, come on, come on, come on, come on. Damn, yo. Huck some more balls. Come on. Damn. Don't we just bite on me? Jerk. I'm trying not to use an Ultra Ball or anything like that. I kind of wanted to stick to Pokeballs. Wow, hurry up. Oh my god. Oh, I didn't start my timer. Oopsies. Uh, who are we going to use? Let's switch to Tsunami. So we can actually take hits. Um, let's do Strength. No! <laughs> oh my god. Damn. Wow. Alright, so I'm going to start training and running around until I find Absol again. So, <laughs> be right back again. Psych, I lied. I'm back. <laughs> Alright, I found another Absol. This one's a little bit lower level, but, you know, I don't, I don't mind that. Right, let's try my shot. No, again! Alright. Be back. Found another one, guys. Three in a row. Alright, this time. We just take down. Crit! Really? Really? Wow! Thank <laughs> you. 
Alright, back again with our fourth Absol. This one is female, level 27, and let's hope not to kill it this time. Okay, alright, alright, we're safe. One shot. No! <laughs> oh my god. Oh man. Alright, be back again. <laughs> <sighs> the fifth one. Please let me capture you. Please let me capture you. Okay, sleeping. Alright. Come on, Pokeball. Please, please, please. No! Let me capture you. Be mine, Absol. Be mine. No, it woke up. Damn, kill my Swablu. What a guy. Uh, rock smash. <sighs> that was close. That was really close. Oh, man. Come on. Please, please, please. No, really? It's like, you can't do damage to my Optimus. My boy Prime. He's too powerful. He's too powerful. You can't hurt him. You can't even scratch him. Oh, my God. I do not want to use... It. Ah. Yes! Got ourselves an Absol. Got ourselves an Absol. Alright, cool. Absol is caught. Absol is there. It was added to a Pokedex. Alright, Absol, the disaster Pokemon. It, sharp it sharply senses even subtle changes in the sky and the land to predict natural disasters. It is a long-lived Pokemon that has a lifespan of, over of 100 years. Are we going to name him? Uh, we are, what are we gonna name him? I don't know, he has like the little pointy thing, point at the screen again, but he has like the little pointy thing on his head, so we're going to name him, uh, Slicer. Alright, Slicer. Cool, we got our newest party member, Slicer. Nice, nice, nice. That's good. Check him out. Uh, he's got pressure. Um, cool. It's high attack. That's great. Uh, nose and move. Taunt. Quick attack. Razor, wind, and bite. Alright, cool, cool, cool. Happy. I'm happy about that. After how many tries? Four tries. Finally got him. You know what? It's all worth it. It's all, all worth it. So, let's see. What are we going to do? I know what I'm going to do. I'm going to... Let's see, how much time do we have left? Uh, we got four minutes. Good enough. Can get one thing done. What other thing I want to be done, done. Alright, so if we go... We're not going to fight Gabby and Ty right now. That's for a later episode. Oh my god. Leave me to be... Thank you. Alright, if we go down here. Look who we see. Steven. Oh, I didn't read what he said. Wait, no. Okay, alright, alright. We go here. We can't get past Steven. Something une unseeable is in the way. So now if we talk to Steven. ABC, are you ready for your battle? Damn, he won't say it. Dang. Dang. ABC, show me your true powers of trainer. And ABC. Not ABC. Steven's going to use something called the Devon Scope, and it's going to show Kecleon, and we're going to have to fight Kecleon, so I'm just going to kill it, I mean, I have no use for it, but Kecleon's special ability is, um, if 
when you attack it, it switches types to that type of move. So like, I use fly and it switched to a flying type, so that's kind of cool. I see your battle style is intriguing. Your Pokemon have obviously grown since the first time I met you in Deford. I like you to have this Devon Scope. Who knows, there there may be other consumed Pokemon or whatever. I don't know what you are saying. I enjoy seeing Pokemon and trainers who strive together. I think you're doing great. Well, let's meet again somewhere. He's going to use Fly and disappear. Excuse me. I'm tired. Let's go up here. Oh, come on. Alrighty. Let's go on over here. And earlier, you know how we couldn't get to the gym? Well, now we can get to the gym. Just go down here. Talk to it. Something unseeable is in the way. Want to use the Devon Scope? Yes, we do. We use the De Devon Scope. An invisible Pokemon became completely visible. Started to flee. Yeah, we got started when it fled. So that Kekalon disappears, and we now have access to the Fortree City Gym. And next episode, we will be taking on the gym. So, how much time do you have left? You got a minute. So, we'll take on the gym next time. Today's episode, I guess we'll do a little bit of training, and I'll end it there. How about we take on Gabby and Ty? Yeah, why not? They're there for us. They're our little fan club that we have. We'll use our new member too. We'll use Absol. Or Slicer. Alright, let's talk to them. Oh, ABC. Oh, you're ABC. Hi, do you remember us from last time? Can you show us how much stronger you've become? Okay, cute interview. Alright, let's fight them. Oh, man. Ooh, I'm worried. Alright, use Razor Wind. Come on. Shit. <laughs> that was quick. Alright, switch to... Oh, damn. That's not good. He's... No, that's not gonna work. Quick attack. Come on. Damn. Alright, good, good, good. Come on. Slicer. No, Slicer! I switch to Optimus. Because why the hell not? Come on. You can do it. Good job. GG, guys. GG. No, we do not want. I don't not want to give you my information. Inform my information. Let's heal up. And call it a quit to this episode. So, yeah. Next episode, we'll take on the Fortree City Gym. If you enjoyed the video, leave a like, comment, and don't forget to subscribe if you already haven't. See you all next time. Bye.